Break now officially a pandemic, and Louisiana's presumptive cases have jumped now from 6 to 13. Governor John Bell Edwards has declared a public health emergency for the state. NBC 10's Maya Hudgens has been following the Louisiana outbreak. She joins us now with more details. Maya. Buddy Michelle, those 13 cases of COVID-19 are in the following parishes, Orleans, Lafouche, St. Tammany, Jefferson, Iberia, and Caddo. In today's press conference, Governor Edwards maintained the risk to the community is still low. On Monday, Governor John Bell Edwards announced Louisiana's first case of coronavirus. I learned that we have a presumptive positive case here in Louisiana. A Jefferson Parish resident who was hospitalized in Orleans Parish. By Wednesday afternoon, that number jumped to 13. The numbers are going to be changing frequently. Uh, we do expect the number of confirmed cases to increase over time. A majority of the cases are in Orleans Parish. Three of those infected are in the same assisted living facility. We are fairly certain now that there is community spread uh, in the Orleans area. Right now, Edwards says the goal is to limit transmission and ensure Louisiana has everything it needs to fight the virus. He signed an executive order Wednesday afternoon. This declaration ensures that state resources are made available uh, to our state agencies and local governments. It addresses uh, issues including price gouging, uh, should that become necessary, as well as prohibiting international travel for state employees to level two and level three countries as designated by the CDC. The population most at risk is the elderly. Edwards warns them to take the necessary precautions. Uh, the best thing they can do is certainly stay away from individuals who are sick, stay away from large gatherings, and reconsidering uh, any travel plans that they have. Fears of spreading COVID-19 have led to the cancellation of several events. Edwards says expect that to be a repeating theme. These cancellations are being done with the public's health and safety in mind, and it's always the case uh, that the health and safety of the public is our number one concern. The administration is reminding the public to wash your hands, cough into your elbow, and stay home if you're sick. They add that the test for COVID-19 will not detect the virus if you don't have symptoms. So if you have symptoms, call your doctor. Maya Hudgens, NBC 10, your local news leader.